we're not in control of this game. Yeah. And the rules of the game can change at will. Well, I was just thinking of the story you told me the other day about your interactions with the airlines and your miles, your your airline miles, how it was oh, yeah. kind of, oh, you, should, you should tell that. that, you should share oh, yeah. that story real quick because it's, it's oh, kind of. It's... So, <laughs> yeah, well, so I'm, I'm going to be going out to Seattle for a bit. Um, and I was using uh, my husband's uh, frequent flyer, with his permission, uh, frequent flyer miles uh, to get the ticket. And um, so, I, so I'm going to be going to Seattle for a bit. And um, uh, yeah, so I needed to get a plane ticket and my husband had frequent flyer miles. So he was going to give me his frequent flyer miles as he should. And um, so I was trying to navigate that and we don't do it a lot. So I he logged in and I was getting the ticket, but... Um, it was, I think I got to the end, but it had the credit card payment for like the $11 in taxes had to be on his credit card and he wasn't at home. So I was like, oh, well, I'll just do it when you like tomorrow when you get back. And so then I did it again for the exact same flight and it costs you in points, right? A certain, like that's the equivalency of the money, right? And then all of a sudden the price had gone up and then it was more, just a little bit more than what we had than the day before, right? And so they said, but you could put your trip on hold and you could buy some points and, um, and in whatever, whatever. So I was like, okay, well, it's like a hundred bucks for these 3000 points, but it's still less than a $600 ticket, whatever, whatever go. So I bought the hundred dollars worth of points and then I go back on and they said, thank you for buying these points. They should show up in about two weeks. <laughs> Like nowhere did it say like there was some like it, it implied it was just immediate like they would transfer the things, so I'm just really pissed at this point and and you know and so I'm like okay well we'll wait wait overnight maybe they'll show up so essentially we waited overnight and then logged back in for the third time and yes they did show up but essentially like the only once flights you could get were like three connections, like red eye flights or something like that for those points. Like you could, you know, I changed up the days, I changed up, you know, and so it was the game. Like they knew I wanted the ticket, right? Cause they knew I jumped through several hoops and they were just, so eventually I just bought a ticket. I just bought a ticket full price and just, because I want, didn't want to do a bunch of stops and a bunch of bullshit. So, yeah. But thank you, American Airlines. Like, you totally were jerking me around in my time. And they got more money out of you. <laughs> yes. I know. And now, yeah, now there's a spend an extra hundred bucks on these points. It's like you're not going to win a game where the rules are written by your opponent and the rules change from minute to minute. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. It's like you're no, dealing with a casino or something. <laughs> the ha house wins again. House always wins. <laughs> They let you yeah. think you, you you got control, but you don't. 